We know, um, Mr. Rial, that Toronto Pack labeling is going to cost $8 billion to consumers, and we've actually heard in this committee that the new plastic ban on fresh produce is going to cost the industry at least $6 billion. So given your business model, and I know you, there's a lot of it to, in, in your stores, how will this, what will this do to the food costs and food availability and food waste? But you know, we didn't do, we did not do yet an evaluation of the exact, you know, incremental, but anything you had, anything you tried to do, you know, to, to on things, then it's not basic thing, then obviously the, the cost of the goods going to, increase and the retail price will increase. So that's another thing that we need to work all together. Mandating things, you know, and not looking at the effect on the consumer, to me it's something we all need to look at. And that's what we do at Costco on a daily basis. So will, will that plastics ban affect the cost of the food in your store? Do you anticipate it, the cost to increase on what you're selling? I, I think it will in certain cases. I think produce is a waste thing can be a problem with it. The, the CPMA had come up and with some study and saying that it's going to increase by 30% the waste. So we'll see. I think we're, we still need to evaluate it. But everything that you had to the net lending costs, consumer will have to pay at a point in time.